Hello guys, so welcome back. In this video, let's have a look on the transpose tool in the Z Modeler tool. So transpose tool is used to transform uh, the polygons. So before getting into the video, I would like to ask you a question. So can you tell me what is 2.5D means? So if you know it, just put it in the comment section. So let's get started into the video. So before we get into the transpose tool, we need to choose the Z Modeler. So I'm going to select the Z Modeler uh, brush in the brushes section and once that is selected I would like to hover the cursor on the polygon face which brings up me the polygon action when in, when hitting the spacebar or right click so when I hit spacebar you get the polygon action and then choose the transpose so transpose has got the targets which are like single poly or poly group etc so I'm going to select a single poly and then just click over the face which brings up my transpose manipulator so here we got uh, the basic uh, moving and uh, rotation and the scale controls over this tool. Not only that, it to make this particular face move, uh, all the polygons are masked here where I could select and drag. Only that polygon is getting affected with the transpose tool. Let's say if I want to uh, get back to the Z modeler again, you need to choose the draw option uh, and then select another face and then bring the transpose tool working for you. You can hit Q on the keyboard and then click those faces and then you could able to see you are switching between the Z modeler and the transpose tool. So uh, you can also, um, uh, you know, um, select different polygon uh, actions or sorry targets. Let's say here I've got polygroup island and then when I click that it just masks uh, all the points except the selected polygroup which I can generally move, rotate and scale around. So if you got any questions related to the transpose tool in the Z modeler, uh, please let me know in the comment section. I also request you to like my video and subscribe my channel to support it. Uh, thank you very much.